Hey guys, what's up? This is Bike Racer and it's Farming Simulator 15 and I'm going to call this officially episode 1 of my gameplay series. So, I did a bit of an introduction and I've also uh, got a forestry introduction video up there, but this is going to be episode 1 of my proper game without any cheating on the Bjornholm um, map. So, let's go into it. So, I've done a little bit since um, my uh, intro video. Um, I uh, emptied my silos of everything to make as much money as I could. So, I got rid of all of the canola, the corn, the wheat, the barley, and the sugar beet. No, not sugar beet. Yeah, I think that's about it. I got rid of all of those. Uh, and all I've done is I harvested the wheat field, I cultivated the field. I sowed the field, as you shall see. So I've sown this field here, ready to go with my uh, combine that looks awesome, doesn't it? Look at that sky! Wow! This is mega. I'm really, really impressed with it, I have to say. I had high hopes, and uh, I haven't been disappointed. So this dude is the one I've been driving around, emptying uh, all of my canola. I've been all over the map, um, sending it to the uh, place with the, uh, where the um, where you get the uh, most money for your uh, for your produce. So I've been driving all over the place. Hence the fact it's a little bit dirty, which hopefully will come to soon to cleaning it with my Karcher pressure washer, which I haven't bought yet. But on date, so cultivator. So this guy is cultivating the original field that was um, that was already that had already grown when you start which I harvested so he's now cultivating that back so I don't have any baling technology. Okay so I still love the animation on the cultivator. It looks so much better than the 13 game. And finally we have this guy planting canola. Now went for canola I know that obviously you don't get anywhere near as big a yield but it's biggest field that you have, so I feel that the biggest field, smallest yield. Uh, again, he's got muddy out there in the field with that, look at that sky. That is awesome. I'm going to do a screenshot of that. Double screenshots. So now this um, is a big deal. Now, I have to admit, I never actually tried this kind of fertilizer in Farming Simulator 13, I ever used, only ever used the massive sprayer, and obviously you couldn't use a worker for that, so I always wasted a lot of time spraying my fields, but this guy, look at him, off he goes, does he turn around? No. It's quite hard to see what bits have been... So you can see it just about out in front of him. It goes pretty quick, 15 miles an hour. It's flat out fertilizing. I might be a little bit late on this farm, I have to say, uh, on this field. Let's see what happens. Does he stop? He stops. Oh, he is turning around. Excrement. That's really good. Uh. Wow, that's a over-engineered turning circle. Uh, he's not quite getting to the edge, but I don't think that's going to bother me too much. So we'll leave that. Uh, what we'll do then, we'll take him over to... So stop. Dismiss worker. I think it looks cool. Look at that. It's mega. Look at that. Sky looks awesome. So I'm going to take this over to press number 9, uh, over to 38, so you see it's actually quite cool, you get a um, little cog on field 38 which shows where your tractors are, or where you've got workers should I say. Um, so I'm going to take him over there which is to the left this way I think, and that right there. So again, looks cool, got to wait on the back so I don't take him over to there, so he can then fertilise where he's been sowing. 
do get lost very easily. <laughs> it's just like real life, I have an awful sense of direction. But, I mean, we're just about to go into night time, it's quite cool, so we'll see what the uh, see what graphics card can handle it to start with. What have I done? I am going in the right direction. It's okay. Uh, oh, there's a fence, I wasn't looking. <laughs> Smooth. I'll just blame it on the massive thing in front. Imagine driving around with that on the front. I mean... A bit dangerous? You look all the way behind you. Oh, you can. Got the mouse on quite slow, as you can probably hear. Yeah, that's a driver like that, but hey. So he's not dirty yet, because he hasn't been in many fields. That's cool. Holy crap. Right, so... Bring him over here and just wait for that to stop. Let's have a look at this and see what the lights look like. That's pretty cool. Oh, can't beat a good bit of beacon action. Uh, right, so this guy, he's going to need to go back to the farm. Where is he? So he's right up in the top right hand corner of the transport company, which is. Well, I last dropped off some of my produce. Uh, yes, yeah, so follow along here. Check out some of the scenery on the way. Is it here at night? Or does it interact? So, if you look in the back of my trailer, it was originally green, and then I put some wheat in it, and it went a bit beige, and then I put some canola, which is actually black in this game, which is quite cool. It differentiates quite a lot more the difference in the, in the crops. So that's now gone black. Oh, it's going for the overtake. And what is blatantly a golf. Or an Audi. That's golf. What's that? Oh, yeah. We have a look at this. Let's pull over here. This is what. Oh, look how cool that looks. Looks mega. Uh, these are the. Look at that! Look at that over there! How cool is that? Lighthouse by the sea. That's awesome. Uh, so yeah, these are what I believe to be the mission control board. The old windmill needs 96 tons of barley. But what I don't understand is... One of our repair services run out of spare parts and you're the only one in the vicinity who can help out. I need a front load. I haven't got that. So I need to track to the tiffer trailer, but... Does it mean that I need to have the barley, or I need to go and get it from somewhere? Let's accept it. And have a go. Right, let's get in this. And go... Oh, typical. Right on the other side of the, uh, the map. Quite like the job board idea. It's actually quite cool, because it's not like... Just random, oh look, a job's turned up, you actually have to go look for it if you want it, which is cool, like that, oh, struggling a bit up, uphill, Got the moon, you bring the stars out, pretty cool sky, I have to say, oh my god, I think we'll get up one day, there we go. In. Okay, so you see the chocks there on the right, on the left of it even. Anyway, where are we going? right or the next right? Next right. Oh, Christ. Nothing to see here. <laughs> Where am I going? Bollocks. So confusing. Oh, I meant to go right. Why did I go left? Right. 
front then, shall we? It just looks cool, doesn't it? It just looks cool. Well, I say cool, but I mean it's cool if you like fine machinery. Don't think it's that cool. Down here. I'm gonna see if I can just go straight down next to the 22. I'm pretty sure we can. I've been down there before. Bit of lag actually with the lights on. Look at that, that looks cool. Thundering along. And my shit box trapped. What for? These are the type of missions that if you just keep it cool. Oh no, I think I'm gonna have to have had the 96. That's not gone well, has it? <laughs> <laughs> but why would you have a mission? But why would you have a mission that is also then cashing in on your yield? I don't get it. Strange one that. <laughs> right, save a bit of time. We're gonna. Well, I'm gonna show you how to reset your vehicle. Slightly different to 13. So, if you want that one, you select. There we go. Reset it. Yes, I want to reset it. This one, reset it. Yes, I want to reset it. So now, I should. B. There he is. Ooh. Right. Take him over there, ready for the harvest. That's now cultivated and ready for sowing. So we can go and put this down somewhere, I think. In my farm. Get rid of it. Oh, no beacon. Makes me sad. No beacon. <laughs> right, let's find somewhere to dump this. Not in the middle of the road, actually. <laughs> Let's put it here for now. Whoop, understeer that. I do quite like that actually. Get rid of that. Right. That frees him up. He's still going. I think. Just like that. Okay, so he's ready to go. Once this guy is done, we will start to fast forward it. So, uh, I will come back when this guy is done. Okay, so he's coming to the end here. I'm not going to let him, you know, do that extra little bit there. There's literally no point. So, let's dismiss the worker. Let's send him back. Yeah, up here left on that. Does that ruin the crop, I wonder? 
that would be annoying if it did. But realistic. Got some canola and some barley growing. We should probably go for some wheat again. Here. Actually, we'll set this guy on his way. Oh, look at that. How cool is that? I am very much a believer of you need to fertilize because otherwise you just don't get the yield, especially with canola, you just don't get the yield. So once he's done that, whoa! <laughs> don't have to worry that that's going to ruin my I'm driving over it. Interesting to find that out. Lights. Quite similar to um, farming sim 13, the lights, I have to say. But anyway, so they're waiting for that. Uh, drive this guy back. And once the fertilizing is done, we're going to power through the night. And, uh, See if we can start harvesting soon over uh, over by year. See, so that's been cultivated, hasn't it? So I'm not going to do anything with it just yet, but he can be there already and waiting. Whoa! <laughs> well, the grass will grow, <laughs> I guess. Right, so as soon as he gets to the end, we will stop him. He'll stop anyway. Stop. Right, so he's done. So now let's smash the time through the night up to 120. Let's. Oops, wrong button. Uh, let's bring them back. To reality. Ah, oh, then we got the problem of. Oh, I'm, I'm gonna have to drive him back. It's not that far. Drive him back. Let's uh, go this way. Left and left again. You'll notice that I do have to look at the map a lot. And say that is not as easy. Get from him. Blah. Left here. Now it's getting proper dark. Oh, the lighthouse. See, it's like th that kind of thing. They didn't need to put that in, did they? But they knew that if they did, be like sick. <laughs> Has anyone ever called a lighthouse sick before? Hmm. I'm not for sure. Right, let's go and part this bad boy up. Out the way. Ah! Oh. Maybe there for now. Come on, grow my pretties. Okay, so. I'll leave it there and we will come back when it's grown, basically. <laughs> See you in a bit. Good morning everyone. Welcome back to the farm. Um, so, through the night and through the morning, this is now grown, so we are ready to harvest some, what I believe to be barley. <laughs> 
double check. Double check. Root types. Bar. Barley or canola? Hmm. I think I've planted two. Canola. Bollocks. Didn't mean to do that. Oh well. Let's hire a worker. Ah, oh, it's the same guy again. No point having the... Okay. We can't, we cannot, can you? So what should we call him then? My worker. A diligent worker. There he is. What should we call him? Is it something... Original? I feel like it's something Amish or something. ZQ or something. <laughs> Zachary, Zachary. What should we call it? It's eleven percent full of one row. But it is canola. Damn it. I thought it was barley. Booger. Oh well. So we stuck on the barley, so that means this guy is gonna do barley then, not wheat. <sighs> Definitely want to buy a um, catch washer. Just look at the state of my tractor. The state of it. It's quite annoying. I'm not going to lie. I was hoping it was barley. I don't know what happened there, but oh well. Um, my bigger field also has got canola in it, that's why I'm annoyed, so I've doubled up. So I might have to sell this field. I suppose the idea will be to get this turned over. Whoa! We need to get this turned around as quick. What are these then? Potatoes and sugar beets. Soil potatoes and sugar beets are unloading them here. Two conveyor belts located behind the hall where you can fill them. Trailers? Yards. Ah, wood chip. When? It's a when, not an if. When I uh, get into a bit of forestry farming. Ah, there's a plough. Interesting. Because I was actually. Where the hell am I going? Uh, one thing I had noticed was, if we have a look over there, there's a field that I'm sure I can plough together. So that might be the next task would be to buy that field and uh, plough it together. Better move this guy out of the way. He's nearly half full. Never came up with a name. Leave your comments on what you think his name should be. What is something original? I don't want it to be like Jack or Peter. I want it to be like Nebuchadnezzar. <laughs> no, not Nebuchadnezzar. Um, Arthur. A good farmer's name, anyway. Leave your comments with what you think I should call it. Most popular one wins. What's that in the middle of the field then? See that? Right. No, not yet. Look at that action shot. Boat's going on. Harvesting. So he's need, going to need to go over by here. Just get around the use of this. We don't need to run around the whole bloody thing. Oops. I'm going to 
going to see how much this field is, see what we can aspire to. So that's quite a good field, and if I then ploughed all of this, it would work well, I reckon. Oh, well, it's quite big, this would be expensive. In fact, it's massive. <laughs> oh well, you have to dream, as they say. Oh, it's not too bad. 57 and a half grand. I got up to about 35 grand before I bought this fertilizer. So, it's achievable. Good two or three fields worth of uh, produce. And we should be hot to trot and ready to rock, as they say. Yeah, they do say that. I, I, honestly. Hey, man. I'll wait for him to get to 80 and stick his pipe out. Excuse me. <laughs> stick his pipe out and we'll uh, load up. I was hoping for a bigger yield, obviously, with barley. I was hoping this would be more intense. But, oh, there we go. Right. Action stations. Actually, we're going to need two names, aren't we? One for the combine driver and one for the tractor driver. See, look, look at the canola. Comes out black. It's not that fast of pouring, is it? At the silo, it pours like a full trailer almost instantly. <laughs> I do love the wheel marks. I think that adds... It's a tiny little detail, but it adds so much, in my opinion. Should we start him cultivating already? Or am I getting a bit eager? Sod it. Let's get cultivating while I stop it, can't I? Then we're going to need a bigger cultivator pretty soon. That is pathetic. It just looks cool. It just looks cool. I just love how muddy it is. The detail. Look at it. And if you go in the cab, I noticed this earlier. Look at the windscreen and look at your footprints on the floor. Okay, so I think that's going to end, I'm going to end it here for episode one. Please like the video and subscribe for more. We're going to be doing a lot more of these. Um, also might do a bit of a um, look at the more expensive kit. There's another series that follows the forestry one. Uh, but yeah, please like and subscribe. And until uh, episode two, goodbye.